Hello, Eid Mubarak everyone. My young artist group of Sharina's Arty Crafty. Today I thought I'll give you the greetings and also teach you some drawing skill. Uh, so like I said always that the basic elements of any painting that you do is drawing and drawing and drawing. So you can try this, these things at home now since we've been locked down and not trying to get bored or uh, frustrated. You can use your time really productively uh, by doing a lot of you know things that you like. So I know that you have a study to do, uh, you're doing it online, but at the same time, I'm sure you have a plenty of time now at home and you can use them very, very creatively and productively. So today I'm going to show you uh, very simple stuff um, like um, still life. You have anything at home, around at your home, um, like any flower vase or pot or something, you know, you can put it in front of you and try to draw that uh, on a piece of paper, canvas, whatever you like. Um, you can use it straight, your acrylic paint or pastel or pencil or pen. I'm not gonna tell you what is the best, whatever actually fit best for you. So whatever you feel very comfortable, okay? So I feel comfortable with the charcoal and chalk. You guys see me all the time in my studio. So today what I'm going to do is, uh, like I said, I'll, I'll draw a still life. And still life I'm gonna show you here. This is what it is. Uh, this is a beautiful, beautiful flower vase that I actually acquired from a flea market. Um, it's a wonderful one. It has a very good shape. Uh, there are a lot of triangle, there are a lot of circle and very intricate work on the surface. But if you are focusing on this design elements on the surface, you'll get lost. Uh, so I would never recommend that you look at those uh, those intricate design and color, but look at the overall shape. Try to study the shape first and then try to draw it. After the drawing, you can always go back to the color and the design and then, you know, put it in your, uh, the piece of work that you're doing. So I have this paper. This is a, ingress animal paper that I got from the Bleak Art Materials. Um, it is a very good paper. It takes charcoal, pencil, everything. Chalk, pastel, whatever, you name it. Um, so I put it there. I have this, you know, charcoal, and then I have some, you know, um, pastel here. Uh, so I'm gonna use them. So let's, Start. Um, so I see that overall is like a circular oval shaped things in front of me. So and I'm trying to put this on this paper in a few minutes. Okay. So you can see that try not to go into too much detail here. I am actually basically putting the basic elements, the shape basically, the shape of the jar, okay? Once you put the shape of the jar, you can actually do other details. So you have a, like a year type of thing here. 
So, this is what it is. Um, you can see the shape again, and this is what I did. Now, I'm going to use a pastel, try to do some detail and the lights here. So you can actually show that it's a three dimensional and the volume. So that's what I did. I look at the lighter part of the vase and the darker part and I'm going to make it even more lighter with the chalk. Oops. Okay, you can always drop your chalk or charcoal. grab it back so that's how it is right now I'm going to show you very closely here okay um, and then if you want you can actually always go to like very integrate design very very carefully like this All right, make it a little darker. All right, so that's how it is. Try this drawing, put a very simple still life like something like this, you can put in front of you, um, which has a nice interesting shape and the light and darkness, uh, so you can see the volume and, um, and do your drawing. All right, that's it for today. Hope you enjoy your day of Eid. And again, try to be very, very creative and productive, try to use this time summertime in a creative way. Do lots of artwork. Send it to me. I'll post it on a Facebook. And as you know, that more like and comments you get, there'll be reward at the end of the year. Okay? Bye.